Can't find love? Hmm. That day is over. With Just Eight Numbers, we can reveal all your secrets to sex and love. We call it Secrets of Birthdays, the Love and Lust Report. Find out the secret to your heart at secretsofbirthdays.com. Hi there, producers, and welcome now to Thursday. Well, sunny and socially sharp or oversensitive today for the Bulls. The moon has now moved into Pisces. So emotional focus is on, frankly, your social life, which is what you're working on this month. Your popularity, your reputation, what the world knows you as, your brands, your context kind of consciousness. Who are you in this room? Who are you in this office? Who am I in this circle of friends? Who am I on this planet? It is the context defining energy. And so in the first stage of today, you might get emotional about what you are or aren't or how people see you or don't. You might get emotional about how far you've come in society or how society is treating you. Remember, your world is always a reflection of who you are. So we're going to get to changing your world by changing you. But we must first get a good readout on your world. So this is in countdown to Lightcast Day tomorrow, where we set our intentions for what you will be and shall be from this point forward. But leading up to that, we're getting some last minute information in. Now, the sun today is ruled by Jupiter. So no matter what you are, you want to experiment today. Maybe you're not clear on what you want to be in the world or who you want to be or how you want to be labeled. Today's a day to educate yourself. When Jupiter rules the day, knowledge is power. So try new things. If you're having conflict with your friends, let's say your friends see you as one way, but you see yourself as different. That might be one of your conflicts. Try something new. If normally you get into an argument with them, don't today. If normally you don't speak up, try speaking up. Try new things today. Educate yourself. Google search. Pick up a book. Read. Basically, expand your options and choices. The more choices you have, the more power you have. And today's a day of expanding your choices and your emotions might lead you to just that. Now, Jupiter itself, which gets tied into the day since Jupiter rules the day, Jupiter itself is in Aries. And Jupiter is saying to Tauruses right now, it's time to decide in the next week what you don't have faith in. It's time to decide what you don't want to subscribe to in your subconscious. I don't want to be afraid of the dark anymore. I don't want to have to, I want to have faith in myself, so I don't want to not have faith. I don't want to doubt myself. I don't want to worry. It's time to decide what aspects of your subconscious, what aspects of your spirituality you want to step away from. Basically, what weeds you want to end and get away from. So it's time to decide. Now, the good news here is, as soon as you decide, Jupiter brings resources to, to deal with it right away. So you don't really have to do anything or change anything. You just have to decide, but pay close attention to how weeds and faith and spirituality play into these roles in society. Maybe, for instance, you are super spiritual, but you're drawing in friends that aren't, or who think you aren't, or who think you're shallow. That's an example of how inner faith can play out to your outer reality, and the two do have probably some sort of link. Now, here to help out today is Sadiqa Salter. She has the Renegade and therapist going live today, and she's going to investigate a Pisces Synergy Energy plant known as Helichrysum. See what Helichrysum can do for you and your popularity and help you go with the flow and be a part of the society you want to be. Sadiqa is live everywhere explaining Helichrysum that Soul Garden streams. All right, Taurus, figure out what you're not when it comes to faith and also figure out what you're not when it comes to society. And tomorrow we rejoin for Lightcast Day. Until then, live, love, be. So.